Abdu Rahmani Tishani, leader of the Niger Junta, has said the military takeover in his country saved Nigeria of an imminent disaster. According to Sheikh Bala La, chairman of Jumatu Izalatu Bida Waikamatu Suna Tishani said this during a meeting that a Nigerian delegation of clerics had with the junta in Niamey, Niger's capital on Saturday. Daily Trust had reported how Islamic scholars who met President Bola Tinibu at the presidential villa in Abuja on Friday headed for Niger. Sheikh Lao quotes Tishani as saying that the coup was well intentioned and that it was carried out to starve off an imminent threat that would have affected not only the Niger Republic but also Nigeria. Given that the statement did not appear to have gone into details, it is unclear what the junta had intended. His assertion nevertheless came after the defense headquarters said that some individuals were pushing the Nigerian military to seize control. Daily Trust reports that there are conspiracies from various reports to incite personnel of the Nigerian armed forces to overthrow the current democratic government according to Brigadier General Toko Gusa, Director of Defense uh, Information. He asserted that the military will continue to carry out its constitutional obligations rather than planning a coup against the current democratic government, stressing that Nigeria's armed forces would not be diverted. The senior military officer referred to the report as highly unpatriotic, wicked, and an attempt to distract the armed forces of Nigeria from performing its constitutional duties. Scholars from the country's major Islamic sects were part of the delegation that traveled to Niger. They included Sheki Ibrahim Dahiru, Baushi, Reb, Sheikh Ibrahim Baushi, Sheikh Yakubu Musa Hassan Katsina, Director Dawa Yamatu Izalatu Bida, Waikamatu Suna, Sheikh Kabiru Gombe and Dr. Khalid Aliya, Secretary General Jamatu Nazri Islam. Others are present included Sheikh Ahmad Abdurrahman, Sheikh Nasiru Abdu Muhayud, Director Amin, Jibwis Jos. Professor Mansu Sokoto and Sheikh Karibula Nasiru Kabara, leader of the Kadriya Group in Nigeria. Professor Salisu Shehu was the Deputy Secretary General of the Supreme Council of, of the Supreme Council for Islamic Affairs. Okay, and uh, let's take the reactions now and stay tuned, please. Uh, well, uh, 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 the, the name here is Message, yes. The Message here uh, spoke and uh, it says, uh, Their bitterness will consume them for asking for military to take over in Nigeria. That is according to Message. Then uh, Amadis, Amadis here did comment uh, saying, uh, This does not make sense to me. He should explain what disaster intended saving Nigeria uh, from. Okay? In other words, he's saying that uh, the military takeover in Niger has helped Nigeria and that uh, it will make uh, the military takeover in Nigeria not to take place anymore. I think uh, there's nothing more than that that he's saying. Then, uh, we have uh, from Oliver Ibene here, Oliver Ibene replies to Amadis uh, Gakia and he says, um, My thoughts too. 
plus two for the rest are star star here says that I prefer even a Bacha regime to having Tinubu as president. Praise NK uh, replied to uh, plus two for saying that I'm with you on this. Uh, Soji replied to plus two for saying that they are take they are talk talking of uh, Niger coup. We are uh, here talking of uh, Tinubu. If you don't have something to say, please keep quiet. Fast line uh, here also commented saying that. Uh, you can see why Igbos have been prevented from leading Nigeria. They are not interested in Nigeria, but they are Biafra. Look at what is happening on our social media. Okay. Then uh, Izo Beha here also commented saying uh, no Christian cleric could go to Niger for peace talk. With the military junta, all they were interested in was to continue to prophesy why the gullible followers are clapping when they are being exploited of their hard earned money. Una son, Una son Siam, Islam is a total peace. Then uh, Sunday, if I shuku John replied to. Izubeha saying, uh, See how uncivilized and uncultured you are. Okay. Then, uh, 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 Pressy uh, Isaac here commented saying, uh, That story for the gods. If so and it's true, why can't you notify Nigeria president of it or? Your president Bazoon again, thorough investigation must be carried out by the DSS and military intelligence, military intelligence unit to fish out the disgruntled elements in the military and among the politicians. Then another here from 905 years, says, Thank you, sir. Help your people out of this problem. Of democracy, okay. Please, uh, we cannot uh, continue with this one. Let's move forward, please. Uh, blessed here says, uh, Where is Barry the close ally to Niger, and what is he saying in times like this? Then, uh, Iria Shah says, uh, Make gonna let us hear what Patrick says, uh, Excuse not acceptable. Then, uh, Guess here says that there is no democratic government in Nigeria, rather a civilian coup where Tinubu ringed himself into power. The only solution in Nigeria is military coup for peace and unity. And this is all I have to take for now. Ensure you subscribe to our channel, share the report across all these platforms, and bye for now. And stay tuned for more broadcasts. Thanks so much for listening. Bye for now, please. Okay.